everyone, it's Patty. Today is Saturday. Chris is working today, so I am with my mom and the kids, and we are headed to Ikea. We have to get a birthday gift for my nephew there, and so I thought it would be fun to bring you guys along and do a shop with me. So, um, yeah, come along with me as I shop through Ikea. So can we just take a moment to talk about this kitchen? I love the sink and the open doors and the, what do you call that thing? I don't remember what that's called, the range. Um, it's just so beautiful and I like that the um, faucet is that like oil rubbed bronze. It's just so pretty. Oh, my dream kitchen when we, whenever we buy a house. I've heard actually if you have IKEA do your kitchens that they're really inexpensive. So. I mean, I wouldn't have Ikea do our kitchen. I'd probably paint whatever cabinets we get. But I definitely would, in the future, want like an Ikea sink because I think they're so pretty and very reasonably priced. So, just so beautiful. I like that print. That's really pretty. And then here's like a room. And then this is when you first walk in. There's the elevator. And then they just have like all these stage rooms. They're just so beautiful. And then here they have another kitchen. This one by far is my favorite so far, but they have another kitchen over here. And I love those plants. I have a few of those. If you saw my birthday uh, vlog, I vlogged here and I bought some of those. And they're so pretty. This is the couch that, like before we um, buy a house, we're going to save enough money to buy this couch also. And it's the Ikea Ektorp. And I just think it looks so comfy and pretty and it's just neutral. So we're definitely going to get this. We got rid of the other couch that we had. This, I think, is just stunning with the pendant lights. I love the table here. I think that's really pretty. And I love, I, I am pro white cabinets, but I really like the gray on these. I like this sink, too. I like the oil rub bronze better, but jute rug, which I think is really pretty. I love the floors. Dream kitchen. So pretty. I love it. Oh, and I love the curtains. Look at those, how pretty. They're like pinstriped. So, so pretty. I love everything about this kitchen. I know a lot of people are always looking for these like garbage bag holders. They have them at Ikea for $1.99. And it just comes flat and you round it and you can just stick it on your wall. How awesome is that? And then here's like a kitchen marketplace area where they have a whole bunch of rods and different things like that. So nice.
quickly come on here and share with you what I picked up. They had tons of cute home decor, but since we're not in a house right now, I didn't really want to pick up any of that stuff. But I did pick up some other things that I have been wanting to get for a while. And since we only go like once a year or twice a year, I figured now was a good time to get them. So the first two things I got were like homeschool related items. Um, we are starting to get more into like drawing and painting and that kind of thing. So I thought it would be handy to have like just one huge roll of white paper. So that is what that is for. And that way the kids could just do whatever they want. And then our paintbrushes are looking pretty bad too. And I do want to get some from Amazon eventually, but for now I went ahead and picked these up from Ikea. And I figured later on I could get those because these were only like a dollar something. And then I love having like a small cutting board on hand, um, like just on the counter for when I chop up like fruit or something for the kids. So I went ahead and got this one. I don't remember how much this was, but I know <coughs> it was really inexpensive. And then for both of the kids' hair, I find myself always needing like to wet their hair when I style it. So I went ahead and picked up this uh, water bottle and I love that it was mint color because that's my favorite color. And then the last thing I picked up, that's Hunter, but the last thing I picked up were these. Um, they are glass bottles and they were, I believe, $2.99 each. And uh, Chris is really getting into making his own cold brew coffee. So I thought this would be perfect for that. And then also for whenever I make like iced tea and things like that. So that is all that I picked up from Ikea. My mom did go with us. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what she picked up too. Because she picked up a lot more than I did. And I helped her pick out some fun home decor things. So I thought it would be fun to share with you guys. That way you have an idea of some of the really neat things they have. So she did pick up for my nephew um, a bunch of art supplies for his birthday and the Ikea easel. If you are ever looking for art supplies, um, they do have some um, for a great price. Now I cannot say how the quality is because I've never used it, but they are definitely priced very reasonably. So she got him some dry erase um, markers and some chalk and then the huge easel she got him. And then also um, one of these. I also forgot to mention I purchased these trays for homeschooling. Also, Leah has one and I love it. We just put all our homeschool stuff on here. So I wanted to get one for Hunter and then I'm putting together a homeschool gift basket for my nephew for his birthday so I wanted to get a tray for his um, gift also so I picked up two of these and then I think that's really it for um, what I purchased the rest my mom got and then this I showed in the vlog um, it's just like a trash bag holder so my mom grabbed one of these and that'll be awesome um, the famous Ikea plants, the sage plants, so she got one of these. I love those. I, if you ever saw my birthday vlog, I picked up some of those. And then she also picked up two of the galvanized planters, a sifter, that's always handy to have, and their kitchen gadgets are really cheap. Um, in a vlog a while back, I talked about having like no uh, storage space in the bathroom that we're using at their house. So they're going to put a shelf there and they've been wanting to do that anyway. So they went ahead and picked up the hooks there because they were reasonably priced. But my dad is just going to do the wood himself because that was a little bit pricier um, at Ikea. So they picked up the hooks for that. And then she also picked up some spray bottles, mint and clear. And then she needed some placemats, and I really like these. I thought she did a great job. We kind of went through a bunch, and we were looking for a reasonably priced, but something cute. She's trying to kind of do some rustic touches because she likes how I decorate, but then she also wants to include, her, incorporate it into a traditional decor. So she got these, and they roll up so it's easy to put away, and these were only $1.99 each. So she got 10 of these. And then she got this placemat for the front door. I think it was $4. She also got my nephew some paintbrushes, like the ones I purchased for my kids. 
And then she got this cute little enamel picture. I have this one in the larger size and she got it for a shelf that I'm going to help her style. So that is everything we picked up on our Ikea trip. There were so many cute things and we definitely added a few things to our list for the future. I hope you found this shop with me and haul fun. And if you have any questions about pricing or anything, let me know down in the questions down below. Also, please let me know what are some of your favorite things from Ikea. And okay. And let me know what are some of your favorite things from Ikea in the comments down below because I know they're like constantly adding fun things to their items. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Can you say bye? Uh, I'm so funny. Okay, go Oh, it's a beautiful bunny. Thank you for sharing. Can you say bye, everyone? Bye, everyone. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. <laughs>